Okay, welcome to day two, the national hunt and the grand national later. But we've got five races before that. And the first one up is the DMPC handicap hurdle over two mile four furlongs with 0 to 110. Number one, fight the power, Leon Van Rensburg. Fast fixer, Daniel French, business lady, Alex Cherry. Little Apple, Carl Arrogante, Sunset Ride, Martin Leadham, Zolano beat Alex Cherry. Disney's Nightmare for Stu Gray, Lizzie's Boy for Darren Howes, Rick Grimes for Graham Clutterbuck, Man Queen for Darren Howes, and Regazzoni for James Follis. Starter's already got him away. The rain coming down, keeping the conditions soft here, as we imagined. So, uh, when we come to the Grand National later in the day, we get to the first fiddle, hurdle in this one, and everybody's over it. And we're being led by Little Apple and Zolano Beat for Alex Cherry and Carl Arrogante. It appears, Carl, that. Uh, the Silks Bugs transferred to other race runners now. It's not just me. It definitely probably is a corrupt little horse somewhere that we just can't seem to locate. So it's Zolano Beat that takes him into the third. Jumps it slowly. Little Apple jumped it faster. But these two are leading by a good couple of lengths to Business Lady in third. Then fourth is Man Queen. Then we've got Disney's Nightmare, Rick Grimes and Fast Fix together. And they're just being followed through by Lizzie's Boy and Sunset Ride. Then we've got Fight the Power and Regazzoni at the rear. But up front, Zolano Beat. Alex Cherry having a lovely little bit of a beat going into the fourth. Jumps it faster than the second place little Apple. Gets away from it well. Extended his lead to about two now. In third at the moment is Business Lady also for Alex Cherry. Being followed through in fourth by Man Queen for Darren Howes. Then we've got Disney's Nightmare for Stu Gray. And the outside is Fast Fix. Which I think is... I'm not sure of those light blue colours. All right, Kevin Meenahan David Robertson. Anyway, I apologise for not knowing that. And then we've got Lizzie's Boy and Rick Grimes. Blue Silks are fight the power. Sunset right out wide and Regazzoni's just at the rear at the moment. But he gets over that fifth hurdle. So, the 3-5. A view of uh, them from a distance here. So going to the 6. Everybody's over it. A few sloppy jumps towards the rear. But it's Solano beat and Little Apple. One and two together. Two neck and neck. Scotland and Norway go past the finishing post together. Sounds like a European Championship qualifier. Scotland versus Norway, probably a draw. Anyway, it's still Zolano beat that's going to lead them out now. There's a little app on his haunches. And they've got a three length advantage over Man Queen and Business Lady. And we've got Disney's Nightmare and Fast Fix. The Blue Silks have fight the power. Uh, followed through by Lizzie's boy, Rick Grimes. Sunset Ride. And still at the rear is Regazzoni. So as we wait for him to get to the next flight. Got over a mile and a, a mile and a furlong roughly to go. And it's still Zolano beating Little Apple. One and two. Been there since the beginning. Man Queen in third for Darren House, pretty much been third most of the way. And we've got Disney's Nightmare, Fast Fix and Business Lady. Fight the power, this is Boy. And get to the seventh. Lucky seven, everybody's over it. And it's Little Apple that just takes it up now. Solano B gives way. And the jockey's pushing him along. Doesn't like to be anywhere but first. They both get over the eighth. Much faster jump there by Disney's Nightmare. Uh, come right up into uh, challenge for first, second and third. They get to the ninth. Three from home. And it's still Zolano beat that leads us. Five and a half furlongs to go. They start this long turn into the home straight. And it's Zolano beat and Disney's Nightmare. The little Apple Man Queen starting to run on now. Lizzie's boy. Regazzoni's coming in from nowhere along the fence. And we've got uh, Business Lady going backwards a little bit on the outside. He's fight the power. The top weight they go over the tenth. The one that's pulling the way now is Zolano beat as Little Apple starts to fall away. So it's Zolano beat that leads us by a couple of lengths to Disney's Nightmare in second. They're starting to pull away from the rest here. They've got a bit of work to do. Regazzoni's coming out of the pack to chase down hard as is Lizzie's boy. But it's still Zolano beat. It's got about a three length advantage over the second. There's only two to go. And it's Solano Beat that leads us with two and a half furlongs left to run. Solano Beat being put under pressure by his jockey, but he's riding him well. And it's still Solano Beat. Gets into the 11th, jumps it fast and well, and gets away with it. Still got a four length advantage over Disney's Nightmare. Lizzie's boy and Regazzoni are trying to cut the gap, and here they come. It's Solano Beat. What is he doing? He's having a rest, and he's been taken over by Disney's Nightmare and Regazzoni. So Regazzoni, Disney's Nightmare on the outside is Lizzie's boy. They've only got Half a furlong left to run. It's Disney's Nightmare. Here comes Lizzie's Boy. Disney's Nightmare needs the post. Disney's Nightmare. Lizzie's Boy. Lizzie's Boy. Disney's Nightmare. Lizzie's Boy. Just
just timed this well. Downhouse takes another win here at Aintree. And a winner definitely for yesterday I called home. Beats uh, Stu Gray's Disney's Nightmare into second. So a good win there for the DMPC for Darren Howes. Third was Regas only for James Follis. Fourth was Zolano beat for Alex Cherry. And fifth was Little Apple for Carl Arrogante. Over to Martin.